Howdy, howdy, folks. A-Train here with you for another episode of Tower 3D Pro. I want to welcome everyone back to the channel. Hope you're having a great weekend. It's a Sunday fun day, and we're going to do a Sunday double play. So make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Turn on that bell icon so you know when we go live or upload a video. And invite your friends to come along and join us on the ride. Let me adjust my microphone here. My new been a nice little uh, weekend upgrade here to the systems and the audio setup that I use. Um, I got uh, the boom mic stand uh, the other night. I'm using my old KJ, AKG uh, Perception 200 microphone, which I've had for like 15 years. It's been sitting in the box and uh, now it's back in business. And that's all running through our M Audio pre USB setup. And now we got new earbuds that came in at some point overnight and thank goodness that uh, they sent a picture showing it on the shelf in one of the two post rooms here at my apartment complex mine is it my my actual post box is in a separate building this one is in with the office building and there's a shelf and they just left it sitting on the shelf I'm like uh what what, what what were you thinking here i mean the other night the guy or whoever delivered the boom brought it up and i mean it was at my door which is great but there's actually an amazon like one of those box wall things where you go up and you punch in a code and it's all secure and the door opens and there's your package and stuff and that wasn't used for either of these so yeah that's uh that was a little unnerving but i got over there uh, and uh we got the new earbuds and they sound great. So uh, let me know if you hear any audio issues. Now, I did make a correction because, excuse me, apparently I didn't have a setting uh, right here in the uh, audio control yesterday. And you guys, because I listened to check it, uh, you guys couldn't hear the pilot feedback and readbacks and stuff. Uh, so I think I've got that corrected. I tested it earlier and it sounded good. Let me know if you hear any issues or something sounds like it needs to be a little uh, louder or anything of that nature. Okay. Uh, also new title screens. I've, uh, the ones I used yesterday, I made based on a picture from DFW airport. These are actually, this is Vegas tower. So, uh, yeah, we're going back to, uh, Vegas McCarran because I'm not going to say the name of it for the Senator it's named for now. And, uh, yeah, no, that's just not going to fly. But uh, we're going to actually run the same session we did yesterday. So this is going to be 0800. So the schedule of aircraft is going to be exactly the same. However, comma, we're going to actually flip the field. We're going to be flying in on the 8s, in and off the 8s and the 1s. All right. So the winds are out of the northeast. Uh, we're going to be long, uh, taking off into the wind today. And it's going to get real interesting because you saw how many planes were lined up to take off yesterday, that's going to completely change. Actually, as my test this morning, I did a few minutes of this and I was like, wait a minute, let me try this. This is different. And sure enough, it was really cool, really efficient, really neat how it worked. So uh, sit back, relax, enjoy as we do uh, some controller in out of McCarran International in Lost Wages. Let's kick this over here. Let's kick this over here. We've already got some planes who have called in. And we are going to roll tide from here. Southwest 399er pushback approved. Expect runway 8 left. Ground 8 left pushback approved. Southwest 399er. Now, this is going to get interesting. Okay. Southwest 364 pushback approved. Expect runway 1 right. Ground 1 right pushback approved. So now they're Southwest putting up their projected path. To the end of the runway but they're not going there okay you'll see what i'm about to do here anything out of this area here the allegiance and southwest on this section of the terminal which i think is d or e something like that anything over here is going to fly off of one right anything from over here and over here is going to fly off of eight left arrivals are going to come in on eight right Ground. southwest three nine or nine are ready to taxi Southwest 399er, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo 3, Bravo. That did not go as planned. Southwest 399er, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo. 
Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo yeah, Southwest 399 er Which is a command they need to correct in the next version of the game. Ground. Southwest 364 ready to taxi. Southwest 364. Runway 1 right at Bravo via Whiskey Delta. Tower. Southwest 1182 so, with Now you see right. what we're doing. Runway 1 right okay. at Bravo via so Whiskey Delta. The Southwest key is this little segment of Bravo right here is going to separate. Departures on 8 are going to go at Alpha 8. Departures on 1 are going to go at Bravo. All right. Southwest 2174, pushback approved. Expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, pushback approved. Southwest 2174. Push, they may push their nose the wrong direction, and I'll have to turn them. I may send them Whiskey, whiskey Zulu Bravo. Southwest 1182, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, clear All to right, land, so Southwest same, 1182. Same schedule as yesterday. First flight, 39er Niners coming here to Dallas Love. Uh, 2174 is going to Denver, New Stapleton. Uh, 364 is going to Tampa, St. Pete. And 1182 is coming in from SeaTac, Seattle, Tacoma International, up in the Pacific Northwest, which we may do a uh, uh, live stream on that next time. So anyway, uh, so yeah, new title screens. Uh, I've gone, I've, I've done a specific one for the airport. And I think I'm going to continue that. I mean, I don't do a lot of live streams anymore with Tower 3D Pro, uh, but I think I'm going to, you know, do some customized ones. And, uh, you know, I think it just adds a nice little touch to it. You guys let me know what you think in the comments and the chat. So we'll have Tower, Delta. Delta 2821 requesting push and start. Yep. Coming up going to Salt Lake City. Delta 2821 pushback approved. Expect runway 8 left. Ground. 8 left pushback approved. You guys are going to see how much Delta smoother this runs. It's really cool. Okay, 2174 actually is in good position now. They can go down Bravo, Bravo 6 to uh, Bravo. And Southwest 4765 is about to call in. Tower, Southwest 4765 with you, runway Coming 8 right. Phoenix Sky Harbor, Southwest 4765, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, clear to land, Southwest 4765. Ground, Southwest 2174, ready to taxi. Southwest 2174, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo 6, Bravo. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo 6, Bravo Southwest 2174. Southwest 364, runway 1 right, line up and wait. Runway 1 right, line up and wait, Southwest 364. Now the key here Ground. is going to be managing Delta 2821, ready to taxi. Delta 2821, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Charlie 5, Bravo. Tower, Allegiant 460 requesting push and start. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Charlie 5, Bravo Delta 2821. Allegiant 460, pushback approved, expect runway 1 right. Ground, 1 right, pushback approved. Allegiant Part of the reason I had to test this earlier was I wanted to make sure I wasn't going to get penalized for having two aircraft because these runways intersect. But they're behind each other, so there's no threat of, uh, you know, a, a, a conflict. Southwest 364, wind is 018 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, clear for takeoff. Wind is 1 8 at 3 knots, runway 1 right clear for takeoff, Southwest 8. 364. There's a difference. <laughs> zero one eight is north northeast, 1 8 is due south. Ground, Allegiant 460 ready College to taxi. Boy. Allegiant 460, one way run right at Bravo via Sierra Delta. Runway 1 right at Bravo via Sierra Delta, Allegiant 460. Tower, United 1115 with you, runway 8 right. United 111. One, Southwest 219 or 2 requesting push and start. United 1115, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, clear to land, United 1115. Right there on the way out. So we're looking good here, looking good here. These looking good. Southwest 219 or 2, pushback approved. Expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, pushback approved. Southwest 2192. Southwest 3999, wind is 018 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. Wind is 18 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, cleared for takeoff, Southwest 3999. Am I not saying 0 before the 18? I'm pretty sure I'm saying it because I can hear myself saying it. Southwest 364, contact departure, 125.9, good day. Roger, good morning. Oops, it's good morning, I forget that. I think it's cool when they say good morning. 
after 9 a.m. they don't say it. So, Southwest 2174, runway 8 left, line up and wait. Runway 8 left, line up and wait, Southwest 2174. That I want to do. I'm trying to do this. Something's being goofy here. Okay, now that's working. There it goes. And this is a Delta 717 on its way to Salt Lake City. Ground, Southwest 2192, ready to taxi. Southwest 2192, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo 4, Bravo. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo 4, Bravo, Southwest 2192. Tower, Allegiant 468 requesting push and start. Southwest 399er contact, departure 125.9er, good morning. Roger, good morning. All right, Southwest 1182, taxi to terminal via Alpha 4, Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Alpha 4, Charlie, Southwest 1182. Allegiant 460, runway 1 right, line up and wait. Runway 1 right, line up and wait, Allegiant 460. Allegiant 468, pushback approved, expect runway 1 right. Ground, 1 right, pushback approved. Allegiant 468. Southwest 2174, wind is 018 at 3 knots. Runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. Wind is 18 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, cleared for takeoff. Southwest 2174. Oh, it's 18 as opposed to 180. Tower. Southwest that's 1006, right. requesting okay. push and start. Okay, I'll get it. I'll get it right. So that's on me. That's on me. Southwest 1006, pushback approved. Expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, pushback approved. Southwest 1006. We're going to move these planes so quick, you guys are going to be like, holy crap. There was no congestion like there was yesterday. Allegiant 460, wind is 19er at 3 knots. Runway 1 right, clear for takeoff. Wind is 19er at 3 knots. Runway 1 right, cleared for takeoff. Allegiant 460. Southwest 1182, hold short of taxiway Charlie 5. Hold short of taxiway Charlie 5 Southwest 1182. So what that will do is once they get moving, so they stop, they think about things and whatever instead of rolling out on the, the you know, high-speed turnoff, Ground. Southwest is they will go across the active and then stop short of Charlie 5. So if we have a plane pop up here, we got it. Southwest 1006, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo 4, Charlie. Oops, hang on. Tower. Southwest 2086 requesting push and start. Southwest 1006, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo. Ground, Allegiant 468 ready to taxi. Allegiant 468, runway 1 right at Bravo via Sierra Delta. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo Southwest 1006. Runway 1 right at Bravo via Sierra Delta, Allegiant 468. Southwest 2174, contact Vegas departure 125.9er, good morning. Roger, good morning. Delta 2821, wind is 19er at 3 knots, runway. Tower, southwest 19er 77 with you, runway 8 right. Delta 2821, runway 8 left, line up and wait. Runway 8 left, line up and wait, Delta 2821. Southwest 4765, taxi to terminal via Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Charlie, southwest 4765. Tower. Southwest 1660 requesting push and start. Southwest 2086, pushback approved. Expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, pushback approved. Southwest 2086. Allegiant 460, contact Vegas departure 125.9er. Good morning. Roger, good morning. Southwest 1977, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, cleared to land southwest 1977. Southwest 1660, pushback approved. Expect runway 1 right. Ground, 1 right, pushback approved. Southwest 1660. Burbank, California. 2086 is going to Houston Bush. And actually, they're not going to Bush. They're going to Houston Hobby. 
Delta 2821, wind is 19er at 3 knots, runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. Wind is 19er at 3 knots, runway 8 left, cleared for takeoff, Delta 2821. Tower, Spirit Wings 9013 with you, runway 8 right. Spirit Wings 9013, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, cleared to land, Spirit Wings 9013. Southwest 2192, runway 8 left, line up and wait. Tower, Southwest 1744, requesting push and start. Runway 8 left, line up and wait, Southwest 2192. Ground, Southwest 1660, ready to taxi. Southwest 1660, runway 1 right at Bravo via Whiskey Delta. Runway 1 right at Bravo via Whiskey Delta, Southwest 1660. Southwest 1182, continue... Southwest 1182, continue taxi. Continue taxi, Southwest 1182. Southwest 4765, continue taxi. Continue taxi, Southwest 4765. Allegiant 468, runway 1 right, line up and wait. Runway 1 right, line up and wait, Allegiant 468. Delta 2821, contact Vegas departure, 125.9er, good morning. Roger, good morning. United 1115, taxi to terminal via Alpha 4, Bravo, Charlie 3. Taxi to terminal via Alpha 4, Bravo, Charlie 3, United 1115. Ground. Southwest 2086 ready to taxi. Tower, Southwest, Southwest 2105 with you, runway 8 right. Southwest 2086, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo, Southwest 2086. Southwest 219 wind is 19 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. Wind is 19 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, cleared for takeoff, Southwest 2192. Southwest 2105, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right cleared to land southwest 2105. Southwest 1006, runway 8 left, line up and wait. Runway 8 left, line up and wait southwest 1006. Allegiant 468, wind is 19er at 3 knots, runway 1 right, clear for takeoff. Wind is 19er at 3 knots, runway 1 right, cleared for takeoff, Allegiant 468. Southwest 1744, pushback approved, expect runway 1 right. Ground, 1 right, pushback approved. <coughs> southwest 1744. United 1115, continue taxi. Continue <coughs> taxi, United 1115. Got a little verklempt there. All right, so everybody's cleared in. We're good to go here. Now we're going to have our little uh, oddball coming in in just a minute. We'll see. You'll see how I deal with them. Excuse me. <coughs> Pardon me. I went sideways quick. Tower. Southwest 852 with you, runway 8 right. Southwest 1660, runway 1 right, line up and wait. Runway 1 right, line up and wait, Southwest 1660. Ground, Southwest 1744, ready to taxi. Southwest 1744, runway 1 right, at Bravo via Whiskey Delta. Runway 1 right at Bravo via Whiskey Delta, Southwest 1744. Okay, those guys are good. Tower. Southwest 1684 requesting push and start. Southwest 1006, wind is 19er at 3 knots, runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. Wind is 19er at 3 knots, runway 8 left, cleared for takeoff, Southwest 1006. Southwest 2086, runway 8 left, line up and wait. Runway 8 left, line up and wait, Southwest 2086. Southwest 2192, contact Vegas Departure 12549 or good morning. Roger, good morning. Allegiant 468, contact Vegas Departure 12549 or good morning. Roger, good morning. Southwest 852, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, clear to land, Southwest 852. Southwest 1660, wind is 19 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, clear for takeoff. Wind is 19 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, cleared for takeoff, Southwest 1660. Southwest 1684, pushback approved. Expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, pushback approved. Southwest 1684. Tower, 711 November Victor with you, runway 8 right. Southwest 1006, contact Vegas Departure, 125.9er, good morning. Tower, Allegiant 472 requesting push and start. Roger, good morning. Southwest 2086, wind is 20 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. 
Wind is 20 at 3 knots, runway 8 left cleared for takeoff southwest 2086. Allegiant 472 pushback approved, expect runway 1 right. Ground, 1 right pushback approved. Allegiant 472. Seven one one November Victor, enter final runway eight left. Enter final runway eight left. Seven one one November Victor. Seven one one November Victor, runway eight left, clear to land. Runway eight left, clear to land. Seven one one November Victor. Southwest one nine or seven seven taxi to terminal via Charlie. Ground Southwest one six eight four ready to taxi. Taxi to terminal via Charlie Southwest one nine or seven seven. Southwest one six eight four runway eight left at Alpha eight via Bravo. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo Southwest 1684. Tower, Southwest 3850 requesting push and start. Southwest 1977 hold short of taxiway Charlie 5. Ground, Allegiant 472 ready to taxi. Allegiant 472 runway 1 right at Bravo via Whiskey Delta. Hold short of taxiway Charlie 5 Southwest 1977. Runway 1 right at Bravo via Whiskey Delta Allegiant 472. Tower. Southwest 5676 with you, runway 8 right. Southwest 1660, contact Vegas departure 12549 or good morning. Tower, Delta 199 or requesting push and start. Southwest 2086, contact Vegas departure 12549 or good morning. Roger, good morning. Roger, good morning. Delta 199 or pushback approved, expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, pushback approved. Delta 199 or Southwest 1744, wind is 20 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, clear for takeoff. Wind is 20 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, cleared for takeoff, Southwest 1744. This guy's tripping. Tower, American 210 requesting push and start. All right, this guy is in the deep over here. Spirit Wings 9013, taxi to terminal via Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Charlie Spirit Wings 9 or 1 3. You'll either take uh, Whiskey or Bravo 6 up. Ground, Delta 1 9 or 9 are ready to taxi. Delta 1 9 or 9 are runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo. Tower, Sky West 5247 with you, runway 8 right. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo Delta 1 9 or 9 are. I think this is going to actually shake out pretty good here because this guy's taxiing. So we're bringing uh, 711 November Victor in on 8 left. So he stays out of the way of the big fast birds because he's, uh, he's already slowing down. Now he's a jet, he's a CNJ, um, but he, he flies a lot slower approach. Southwest 5676, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, clear to land, Southwest 5676. Skywest 5247, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, clear to land, Skywest 5247. Spirit Wings 9 or 1 3, hold short of taxiway Charlie 5. Hold short of taxiway Charlie 5, Spirit Wings 9 or 1 3. American 210, pushback approved, expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, pushback approved. American 210. Southwest 3850. Pushback approved. Expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left. Pushback approved. Southwest 3850. If he pushes nose left like that, then I'm going to put him on 1 right. Southwest 1744, contact Vegas departure. 125.9er, good morning. Roger, good morning. So Delta passed across the nose here. So now, Southwest 1977, continue taxi. Continue taxi, Southwest 1977. Southwest 2105, taxi to terminal via Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Charlie, Southwest 2105. Ground, Southwest 3850, ready to taxi. Southwest 3850, runway 1 right via... Ground, Hold American on. 210 ready to taxi. Southwest 3850, runway 1 right at Bravo via Whiskey Delta. Runway 1 right at Bravo via Whiskey Delta, Southwest 3850. Right, this moron is still looping around on the Pentel. This airplane's broken, so I'm going to delete them. Goodbye.
ain't got no time for that. Southwest 852, taxi to terminal via Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Charlie, Southwest 852. Spirit Wings 9013, continue taxi. Tower, United 2421 with you, runway 8 right. Continue taxi, Spirit Wings 9013. American 210, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo, American 210. This guy's going to turn the corner, keep going. So now we're holding the departures here as 711 November Victor is coming in over top. United 2421, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, clear to land, United 2421. And the key here is once this guy's on the deck, there's going to be multiple places he could turn out. If he stops before Alpha 5, we're golden. But we're going to be able to move traffic across here in front of him. Southwest 1684, runway 8 left, line up and wait. Runway 8 left, line up and wait, Southwest 1684. Yeah, he's going to stop before Alpha 5. Tower, so this is 1141, Charlie requesting push and start. 1141, Charlie, push back approved. Expect runway 1 left. Ground, one left pushback approved. 1141 Charlie. Southwest 2105, continue taxi. Continue taxi, Southwest 2105. Southwest 2105, hold short of taxiway Charlie 5. Hold short of taxiway Charlie 5, Southwest 2105. 711 November Victor, taxi to ramp via Bravo Hotel. Taxi to ramp via Bravo Hotel, 711 November Victor. Tower, Southwest 461 with you, runway 8 right. Southwest 461, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, clear to land, Southwest 461. So you guys see the Ground, see the, one how one this works Charlie, now? ready to taxi. 1141 Charlie, runway 1 left at Whiskey via Hotel. One one four one Charlie, runway 1 left at Runway 1 left 1141 one, Charlie. Run Jesus. 1141 one, Charlie, runway 1 left at Whiskey via Hotel. Runway 1 left at Whiskey via Hotel 1141 one, Charlie. See if you figure this out. Yep, I figured it out. Good. Southwest 1684, wind is 21 at 3 knots. Runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. Wind is 21 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, cleared for takeoff. Southwest 1684. Delta 199er, runway 8 left, line up and wait. Runway 8 left, line up and wait, Delta 199er. Southwest 5676, taxi to terminal via Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Charlie, Southwest 5676. Southwest 3850, runway 1 right, line up and wait. Runway 1 right, line up and wait, Southwest 3850. Delta 199er, runway 8 left, line up and wait. Runway 8 left, line up and wait, Delta 199er. Oops. Delta 199er. <laughs> runway 8 left, line up and wait. Runway 8 left, line up and wait, Delta 199er. Southwest 852, continue taxi. Continue taxi, Southwest 852. Southwest 2105, continue taxi. Continue taxi, Southwest 2105. Get him across the active. He's pulling up next. Sky West 5247, taxi to ramp via Alpha 4, Charlie. Skywest 5247, taxi to terminal via Alpha 4, Bravo, Charlie 3. Taxi to terminal via Alpha 4, Bravo, Charlie 3, Skywest 5247. Southwest 1684, contact Vegas, departure 12549, or good morning. Roger, good morning. Delta 199er, wind is 21 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. Wind is 21 at 3 knots, runway 8 left cleared for takeoff, Delta 199er. Southwest 3850, wind is 21 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, clear for takeoff. 
Wind is 21 at 3 knots, runway 1 right cleared for takeoff southwest 3850. 711 November Victor, hold short of taxiway whiskey. Hold short of taxiway whiskey 711 November Victor. Now that should clear them across both active runways. Tower, up. southwest 501 with you, runway 8 right. American 210, runway 8 left, line up and wait. Runway 8 left, line up and wait, American 210. Southwest 5676, continue taxi. Continue taxi, Southwest 5676. Skywest 5247, hold short of taxiway Charlie 2. Hold short of taxiway Charlie 2, Skywest 5247. So I'm going to clear him across the active. Zoom, 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 in the boom, boom. Southwest 501, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right clear to land southwest 501. Delta 199 or contact Vegas departure 12549 or good morning. Roger, good morning. Southwest 3850, contact Vegas departure 12549 or good morning. Roger, good morning. All right now, this guy sees across both the actives, he's going to hold short of whiskey, which is right here, which is where 1141 Charlie is going to line up. And these guys are parading across together. Tower, Southwest 1467 requesting push and start. Southwest 1467 pushback approved. Expect runway one right. Ground, one right pushback approved. Southwest 1467. 1141, Charlie. Wind is 21 at 3 knots. Runway one left, clear for takeoff. Wind is 21 at 3 knots. Runway one left, cleared for takeoff. 1141, Charlie. United 2421, taxi to terminal via Alpha 4, Bravo, Charlie 3. Taxi to terminal via Alpha nope. 4 Bravo Charlie 3 United 2421. United 2421, taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 Charlie Charlie 5. Taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 Charlie Charlie 5 United 2421. American 210, wind is 21 at 3 knots. Runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. Tower, Spirit Wings 1068 with you, runway 8 right. Wind is 21 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, cleared for takeoff, American 210. Spirit Wings 1068, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, clear to land, Spirit here. Wings 1068. Ground, Southwest 1467, ready to taxi. Southwest 1467, runway 1 right at Bravo via Whiskey Delta. Tower, Southwest 3183, requesting push and start. 711 November Victor, continue taxi. Runway 1 right at Bravo via Whiskey Delta, Southwest 1467. Continue taxi 711 November Victor. United 2421, hold short of taxiway Charlie 6. Hold short of taxiway Charlie 6, United 2421. Get him across the active and out of the way. Boom, boom. Beautiful thing. There, you're done. You're done. 3183, you're in departure. Where is this guy going? He's going right there, so he should be okay. Southwest 3183, pushback approved. Expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, pushback approved. You really want to have at least two gates. You know, one or two gates. You, you don't want to push back planes adjacent to each other, but two gates apart, you should be okay. Uh, on the older airports can be a little dicey because sometimes they get wonky with how they get pushed back. American 210, contact Vegas Departure. 12549er, good morning. Going to Roger. John F. Kennedy, good New morning. York. What's the F stand for? Tower. FN. Southwest 1036 with you, runway 8 right. 1141, Charlie, contact Vegas Departure. 12549er, good morning. Tower, Allegiant 416 requesting push and start. Roger, good morning. Southwest 461, taxi to terminal via Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Charlie, Southwest 461. Southwest 461, hold short of taxiway Bravo 4. Hold short of taxiway Bravo 4, Southwest 461. I think we just had an airplane disappear, didn't we? We had two airplanes here pushing back, didn't we? Did it break? What happened? Allegiant 416, push back approved, expect runway 1 right. Ground, 1 right, push back approved. Allegiant 416. Yeah. I think the game just deleted an airplane on us. Or well, they pulled it off. Tower, Spirit Wings 808 requesting push and start. Spirit Wings 808 pushback approved. Expect runway 1 right. Ground, 1 right pushback approved. 
Spirit Wings 808. Southwest 1036, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, clear to land, Southwest 1036. Southwest 1467. Wind is 22 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, clear for takeoff. Wind is 22 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, cleared for takeoff, Southwest 1467. Ground, Southwest 3183, ready to taxi. Southwest 3183, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo, Southwest 3183. Ground, Spirit Wings 808, ready to taxi. South Spirit Wings 808, runway 1 right at Bravo via Whiskey Delta. Runway 1 right at Bravo See via Whiskey cool Delta, Spirit Wings 808. how cool it is to run the airport this way? We're using all four runways. Two for arrivals, although really we're not using eight left for arrivals. We're using three for departures, and actually now we've used, yeah, three of the four. One left, one right, and eight left. Ground, Allegiant 416 ready to taxi. All right, let me give this guy another 30 seconds to kind of get moving here. Nice. Skywest 5247, continue taxi. Continue taxi, Skywest 5247. I thought I had him hold short of Charlie 2, but maybe they didn't catch that, or maybe there was something tied into it. It's Charlie 2 parallels Charlie 3. Allegiant 416, runway 1 right at Bravo via Golf Whiskey Delta. Runway 1 right at Bravo via Golf Whiskey Delta, Allegiant 416. Negative. Allegiant 416. Yeah, so that's a citation there. Citation 9, maybe? Tower, Southwest 1053, requesting push and start. Southwest 1467, contact Vegas departure 12519 or good morning. Roger, good morning. Tower, Southwest 240, requesting push and start. Yes, he's moving, so he's good. Skywest is good. He's good. 461. Southwest 461, continue taxi. Continue taxi, Southwest 461. See, this is the other one that was up a minute ago, but for some reason, like, canceled out. Southwest 240, pushback approved. Expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, pushback approved. Southwest 240. So another flight land from SeaTac. That's a Spirit Wings flight. Then we had one land from Houston. Uh, that should be Houston. Yeah, it's uh, Houston Hobby. IAH is Houston Bush Intercontinental. HOU is uh, Houston Hobby, which is on the south side of town. Bush Intercontinental is out the east side of the city, out past the 610 loop. Spirit Wings 808, wind is 22 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, clear for takeoff. Wind is 22 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, cleared for takeoff, Spirit Wings 808. Southwest 501, taxi to terminal via Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Charlie, Southwest 501. Southwest 501, hold short of taxiway Bravo 4. Hold short of taxiway Bravo 4, Southwest 501. Southwest 3183, runway 8 left, line up and wait. Runway 8 left, line up and wait, Southwest 3183. Yeah, it's fun running this airport this way. I mean, it look, I mean, it's just super efficient. Tower. Spirit Wings 562 requesting push Super and start. Super efficient to do it this way. All right, Spirit Wings 808 is on roll. Now, do not push two airplanes side by side like this, okay? So we got one pulling in. Wait till the one gets in and on the gate because if the 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 spacing is sometimes wrong on these older airports and you will get a penalty because oops, airplanes collided because yeah. Spacing's wrong. Southwest 1053, pushback approved. Expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, pushback approved. Southwest 1053. Spirit Wings 1068, taxi to terminal via Charlie. Tower, Southwest 1140 with you, runway 8 right. Southwest 3183, wind is 22 at 3 knots. Runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. 
Taxi to terminal via Charlie Spirit Wings 1068. Wind is 22 at 3 knots, runway 8 left cleared for takeoff southwest 3183. Spirit Wings 562, pushback approved, expect runway 1 right. Ground, 1 right, pushback approved. Spirit Wings 562. Spirit Wings 808, contact Vegas departure 125.9er. Good morning. Tower, southwest 3431, requesting push and start. Roger, good morning. Southwest 3431, pushback approved, expect runway 8 left. Ground. Eight left pushback approved. Southwest I'm three four three one. To one right. If they push tail right, I should be able to give them the command to push tail left. But that's okay. I'm not going to sweat it. It's all good. Spirit wings one zero six eight. Hold short of taxiway Charlie five. Hold short of taxiway Charlie five. Spirit wings one zero six eight. Get them across the act Ground. here. Spirit wings five six two. Ready to taxi. Allegiant 416, wind is 22 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, clear for takeoff. Wind is 22 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, cleared for takeoff, Allegiant 416. Southwest 3183, contact Vegas departure 125.9 or good morning. Roger, good morning. Spare wings 562, runway 1 right at Bravo via Whiskey Delta. Ground, southwest 1053, ready to taxi. Runway 1 right at Bravo by Whiskey Delta Spirit Wings 562. Spirit Wings 562, runway 1 right at Bravo via Bravo 6 Whiskey Delta. Runway 1 right at Bravo via Bravo 6 Whiskey Delta Spirit right. Wings 562. Yeah, 3431, we're going to put on one right. Southwest 3431, ready to taxi. Hold, please. Ground, Southwest 240, ready to taxi. Southwest 1053, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo Southwest 1053. Southwest 1036, taxi to terminal via Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Charlie Southwest 1036. Southwest 240, runway 8 right. Nope. Southwest 240, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo Southwest 240. Tower. Allegiant 400 requesting push and start. Southwest 1036. Hold short of taxiway Charlie. Hold short of taxiway Charlie Southwest 1036. Southwest 1140 runway 8 right clear to land. Runway 8 right clear to land Southwest 1140. Southwest 3431 runway 1 right at Bravo via Whiskey Delta. Runway 1 right at Bravo via Whiskey Delta Southwest 3431. Southwest 501, continue taxi. Continue taxi Southwest 501. Southwest 240, hold short of taxiway Charlie. Hold short of taxiway Charlie Southwest 240. I do not want to have a conflict here. This guy looks like he wants to go somewhere. He's going to SBN. I'm not sure where that sand burner. Do you know maybe? I don't know. Allegiant 400, pushback approved. Expect runway 1 right. Ground, 1 right, pushback approved. Allegiant 400. Tower, Allegiant 436, requesting push and start. South Bend. South Bend, Indiana. Okay. Got it. KSBN is South Bend, Indiana. Home to Fort Irish. All right, so this guy's heading in there. This guy should be gone by the time he gets there. Southwest 240, continue taxi. Continue taxi, Southwest 240. Allegiant 436, push back approved. Expect runway one right. Negative. Allegiant 436. Allegiant 436, push back approved. Expect runway one right. Ground. One right pushback approved. Allegiant 436. Allegiant 416. Contact Vegas departure. Allegiant 416. Contact Vegas departure. 125.9er. Good morning. Roger. Good morning. Southwest. KNR RNO. Southwest 1140 is coming in from Reno, Nevada. Spirit Wings 1068. Continue taxi. Continue taxi. Spirit Wings 1068. Spirit Wings 562, wind is 23 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, clear for takeoff. Wind is 23 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, cleared for takeoff, Spirit Wings 562. Southwest 1053, runway 8 left, line up and wait. 
Runway 8 left line up and wait southwest 1053. Southwest 1036, continue taxi. Ground, Allegiant 400 ready to taxi. Continue taxi southwest 1036. Allegiant 400, runway 1 right at Bravo via Golf 2, Zulu, Whiskey, Delta. Ground, Allegiant 436 ready to taxi. Allegiant 436, runway 1 right at Bravo via Delta. Runway 1 right at Bravo via Golf 2, Zulu, Whiskey, Delta, Allegiant 400. That's dumb. Runway 1 right at Bravo via Delta, Allegiant 436. Allegiant 436, runway 1 right at Bravo via Papa, Delta. Runway 1 right at Bravo okay. via Papa Delta, Allegiant 436. Yeah, turn that corner a little easier. There you go. That'll make it happy. Nice, a little easier on the nose gear. Uh-huh. That's how that works. Don't stress that. No reason to. Southwest 1053, wind is 23 at 3 knots. Runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. Wind is 23 at 3 knots. Runway 8 left, cleared for takeoff. Southwest 1053. Going to SMF. Stupid mother. What? What is that? <laughs> KSMF. KSMF. Uh, Point. Sacramento, California. The capital of the People's Republic. Hope everyone's having a great Sunday fun day here on the channel. Well, welcome you aboard. I'm A-Train. We're doing some Tower 3D Pro. Running at Vegas McCarran. We're running, uh, we're departing off the 8 left and 1 right runways. Arriving on 8 right. We have moved a bunch of airplanes Tower. here. Very Southwest quickly, very efficient. Requesting push and start. Southwest 1140, taxi to terminal via Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Charlie Southwest 1140. See, we had two planes take off there simultaneously. Pretty cool, huh? Spirit Wings 562, contact Vegas departure 125.9er. Good morning. Roger. Good morning. Southwest 1053, contact Vegas departure 125.9er. Good morning. Roger. Good morning. All right. He's pulling in the park. He's pulling in the park. He is waiting to get pushed out. Where are you going? Phoenix Sky Harbor, Southwest 9 to 4 8, pushback approved. Expect one runway, one right. Ground, one right, pushback approved. Southwest 9 or 4 8. Southwest 3 4 3 1, wind is 2 3 at 3 knots, runway one right, clear for takeoff. Wind is 2 3 at 3 knots, runway one right, cleared for Take takeoff, off, Southwest eh? 3 4 3 1. Southwest 2 4 0, runway 8 left, line up and wait. Runway 8 left, line up and wait, Southwest 2 4 0. We'll see how long it takes this guy to get moving. And he's moving. Southwest 1140, hold short of taxiway Bravo 4. Hold short of taxiway Bravo 4, Southwest 1140. Really, you need to have him hold short at all, unless something pops up last minute along here. Good to have these little safety checks checkpoints, though. You know, that clears him across the active, gets him moving. Notice I had this guy line up and wait. I told it, gave this guy permission to take off. This guy had line up and wait. It's going to take them a second. This guy's on the move. I don't want him to stop. I want him to just keep on, keep on, keep on moving with Twix. Anyway, I hope everybody's having a great day. Welcome to the channel. A little Tower 3D Pro controller in action, and then we'll take a little break and be back with uh, Farming Simulator 22, I think. Is everybody able to hear the, uh, the pilot uh, readbacks? Should be. I made an adjustment. I apologize for yesterday's video not having that, but there was the audio. Tower, 6030 Zulu with you, runway 8 right. Rocky Jet Project, you like this? Ground, a learning curve difficult. Nine or four, eight, ready to first taxi. off, welcome to the channel, Rocky. Appreciate you being here. Uh, it's, okay, so there's a couple things to it. Let me hit the pause key here. Uh, it's not terribly difficult. The base game for Tower 3D Pro and I recommend you get the pro version because that's the one with the voice recognition system. If you just get Tower 3D, it's all GUI interface. You have to click here, then here, then whatever. All right. So get the pro version. Um, it starts off with St. Kitts, which is your training airport, which is okay, whatever. And then you also get uh, KPHL, Filthy, Philadelphia. And you get LAX, Los Angeles International, which is a challenge. So it kind of gives you a easy airport a two runway airport which you can actually run three on and then a more difficult airport when you start running dual parallel runway operations okay so it, it's a matter of the uh, of practice which 
gee, A train, that's brilliant insight. That's like, duh, for anything. Um, learning the things to say, like what I'm telling these pilots on these departures here. Allegiant 400, wind is 23 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, clear for takeoff. Actually, I'm going to clear that out. Uh, you, you just hold the button down. Don't release it because I just realized this guy's still on the runway, although he may be off the ground by the time he entered. Um, so I wasn't paying attention there. Uh, so some of the commands can be a little goofy. It's just a matter of learning them. It's not a really steep learning curve. The game sets you up for success in going from a one runway operation to a two runway operation to a four runway operation. Okay. And then you can control all this by setting up what runways you want to land or take, you know, take off on based on the winds. The winds aren't terribly realistic unless you do stormy weather, then it gets kind of sideways. So uh, the fun part for me is adding in a little bit of realism with the commands. The standard command, you don't have to read the wind direction. Allegiant 400, runway one right, line up and wait. Like runway that one, command right, up and wait, Allegiant four tells zero, the aircraft zero. pilot he can pull onto the runway and park and stop. So wait for my command. Southwest is sitting active on the runway, burning gas. We're going to get him going. Southwest 240, wind is 24 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. Wind is 24 at 3 knots, You don't have to say all that. All you have to do is say Southwest 240, runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. You don't have to read the winds to them. But it's more realistic if you do read the winds to them, so it sounds cooler. Now, here's something that's a little bit of game knowledge. Now, how I give this command for uh, Southwest 3431, all I've got to say is Southwest 3431 contact departure. Boom, done. But uh, I like to be a little more specific with it. Southwest 3431, contact Vegas departure, 125.9, good morning. Roger, good morning. Okay, so I just fed them some information that you wouldn't get out of the game otherwise and made it a little more interesting. All you have to say is contact departure and then you can say good morning or whatever. After nine o'clock, they'll start saying good day. Good day, eh? Allegiant 400, wind is 24 at three knots. Runway one right, clear for takeoff. Wind is 24 at three hey. knots, runway one right, cleared Where for takeoff. Where is FS 22? Uh, well, uh, you didn't catch the stream, the stream last night. Allegiant 436, runway one right, line up and wait. Runway 1 right line up and wait Allegiant 436. Southwest 1140, continue taxi. Continue uh, taxi so southwest some one of the one safety zero. margins are good to know here as well. Southwest 9 or 48, runway 1 right at Bravo via Gulf Whiskey Delta. Runway 1 right at Bravo so via Gulf Whiskey Delta, just southwest done, 9 or 48. Let me, let me show you, because you saw how the blue line had him coming to the end of 1 right. I said at Bravo, so this is the Bravo taxiway via Gulf Whiskey Delta, which was actually his planned route, but to go to the end of the runway. He would have had to cross my active here, which wouldn't hurt because I'm having aircraft depart off of eight left at Alpha 8. But, so there's no conflict whatsoever. I'm having these guys depart at Bravo, these guys depart at Alpha 8, and you just have to give that specific command. FS-22 will be coming up shortly. It's a Sunday fun day, and we're doing a double play. Southwest 240, contact Vegas departure, 125.9er, good morning. Roger, good morning. Allegiant 400, contact Vegas departure, 125.9er, see ya. Roger, good morning. Now, I threw in a see ya there, why? Because of Citation Max. If you watch Citation Max's channel, he's a really cool young dude who's uh, jet qualified. He flies a Citation, um, geez, CJ da, Plus? Yeah, pretty. It's pretty awesome. Anyway, so you get ATC and everything on that, and that's what he'll he'll say. See ya, as a pilot, and you'll hear the air traffic controller say see ya. Uh, sometimes, so it's it's really kind of cool. Allegiant four three six. Wind is two four at three knots. Runway one right. Clear for takeoff. Wind is two four at three knots. Runway one right. Cleared for takeoff. Allegiant four three six. Oh yeah, it, it's it's really awesome. And um, now I think there is a um, 
I think there is a a version, a different, maybe a different air traffic control, or it may be a like at a uh, network, not a network level, a uh, center level that's actually tied into Microsoft Flight Simulator, where you can either be the pilot or you could be the flight controller. So it's kind of cool. Um, but yeah, this it's a lot of fun. It's 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 really cool. The the two things you've got to do now is you've got to get the base game, okay? And then you get it comes with a bunch of generic airlines. So there's no copyright issues as far as the developers go. Um 6030 Zulu. 6030 Zulu enter final runway 8 left. Enter final runway 8 left. Now they were coming in on 8 Zulu. right. Now watch on the strip here, you'll see it says 8 right. Now it's crossed out. 6030 Zulu, runway 8 left, clear to land. Runway 8 left, clear to land. Now, why did I do that? Zulu. I just moved them from the arrival runway to the departure runway. Well, it's because they're a little BEC, which is a really slow plane. I mean, look, they're going 121 knots now, whereas Allegiance departing out at 250. Allegiance 436, contact Vegas, departure 125.9er. Good morning. Roger. Good morning. So... Southwest 9 or 4 8, wind is 2 4 at 3 knots. Runway 1 right, clear for takeoff. You've got to get the base game. Knots, runway 1 right, cleared for takeoff. Then you've got to get. Um, uh, what's it called? Oh, there's real color and there's real. Uh oh. Um, shoot, I'm forgetting what it's called. Real traffic. All right. So let me. I'm going to type this in the chat so you. I make sure that you know exactly what you need to get. All right. So Tower 3D Pro. Real traffic. Real color. All right. So Tower 3D Pro is the game and that uses the voice interface, right? So you got to have a good microphone, and the key is to enunciate your commands. All right, so you guys speak clearly, you know, draw them a picture, break out the crayons um, so that they don't go, do you understand the word coming out of my mouth? Um, oh, awesome. Yeah, you know what? This And, and I would, um, if you're going to buy this, wait till it goes on sale because they have, like, really good sales. They should, I don't know, they may have a Mother's Day sale coming up or whatever. You can get the base game. Always wait till the airports themselves go on sale because they sell airports like DLCs. And here's the thing. Like I just listed in the chat, if you buy a new airport, you have to buy a real color for that airport. Now, what does real color mean? See how that's a pretty Southwest jet? If you get the base game, you're going to get Numbnuts Airlines Tower, and Southwest two, two, three, four with Blanky runway, Airlines right. and whatever. Okay, So it's a bunch of fake airlines. When you install the real traffic mod, which, all right, so an airport typically runs 20 bucks full fare. You only have to, um, the game runs, I think, about 40 bucks full fare for 3D Pro. Don't quote me on that, but check on Steam or on feelthere.com. So, and there's a Steam package. I think you can get the base game, and it comes with more than three airports. So that's something to look into, too, to save yourself some money. But anyway. Let me clear him out of here. Southwest 9 or 4 8, contact Vegas Departure 12549 or good morning. Roger, good morning. So now see how 6030 Zulu is going 96 knots, 95 knots. He is putting his way in here. And here comes Southwest 2234 screaming along at warp speed. Southwest 2234, runway 8 right, clear to land. It's coming runway in from Santa Ana, Orange Southwest County, two, John two, three, Wayne, four. SNA. Um, so. Uh, I move 6030 over onto the departure runway because I can better control traffic on the departure. Not that we have any departures at the moment. But there he can land. He'll probably stop by Alpha 8. And then I can get him out of the way and moved over here. These are the uh, GA ramps here and here. These are the... What are they called? They're, um, uh, these are the aircraft that go out the Tonopah test range. Uh, I forget their, their names. All right. So you got to get real traffic Tower. because Southwest real traffic gives you the real airlines. Okay. If you install real traffic, though, all of the airplanes will then just be white. 
then you have to get real color for the airport and then the color schemes for the aircraft will be correct Does that makes sense so then once you have the base game real traffic is like less than ten dollars real color for the base three uh comes together so for st kitts philadelphia and lax there's a real color package for all three airports okay tower now southwest 783 with you runway eight right excuse me um another note about that is once you install real color on one airport it will cover a lot of the jets for a lot of the airports because a southwest 737 800 at um orlando is going to look pretty much the same as it does at um new york laguardia and at vegas okay but when you sometimes there's models that are different models that fly into the different airports so then you may see an airplane that's naked white and that's because you don't have real color installed for that airport they they have to do it for that particular airport so here's another bit to this fieldair.com is the developer of the game but Nierge's design uh yes they have sky harbor yes i have sky harbor yeah they have kphx so uh Nierge's design does a lot of the airports and does the real color and real traffic all right so you you'll be looking for that and you'll be going through them and what happens is when you buy one of these things they email you and it has a product code and then you put the product code in so you can download whatever but with real traffic if you say you buy the base game and then you say buy phoenix Scar Har sky harbor because you want phoenix sky harbor you buy phoenix sky harbor if you get it at full fare it's going to be 15 to 20 dollars plus you need real color for it okay so that's going to run about twin at, at most about 26 27 dollars if you catch it on sale it'll be between 10 and 15 dollars plus four to five dollars for real color so you can save 25 to 40 percent on airports if you catch them on sale you see what i'm saying so that's what i'm encouraging you to do so maybe get the base game even if you pay full fare for it get real traffic and real color and you'll see the package for real color is for k or tist kphl klax right am i making sense here real traffic then gives you the real airlines and real color gives you the paint schemes for the airport that you're operating eventually as you add new airports you have to download the airport and the uh, real color for that airport but then well actually once you download real traffic you should have the most recent version of real traffic and uh, because along the way they're, they're not putting out new airports like they used to they're working on the next generation of the game so if you just want to get into it I wouldn't put a whole lot of investment into this because in the next year or so the next generation of the game should be coming out so I'll save you some money that way too all right but um, used to be if you downloaded a new airport you had to you had to just really download real traffic uh, because they would update the real traffic files and that would cover airlines going into that airport so, so maybe you know Kathmandu Airlines goes into the new airport you have but didn't go into Philly or LAX so it's not going to show up in the files so you got to re-download the original uh, real traffic it gets updated with every new airport that they put out and then you've got everything you need to run the new airport okay <sighs> I know it's lots of explain you asked me a simple question I built you a clock but I'd rather you understand all elements to this and that way I can save you some money because then maybe you consider donating it to the channel hey <laughs> link in the description below to our PayPal site by the way um, and then if you want to see like a list of the airports there's a couple things you can do you could go to uh, steam uh, you could go to fieldair.com if you want to see the list of airports I have and I have most of the airports uh, there's a link to my discord down in the description below click on that join my discord page and you'll see uh, tower 3d pro yes absolutely it is absolutely it is and they've got some old-school uh, stuff they do too they have a, a, a real color package that goes back to the days of like Braniff 
and stuff of the like 70s and 80s. I think Piedmont and Eastern stuff may be on there. So, um, all right. Hey, I got a flight coming in for D from Dallas Love Field. Let me get that on the deck here. And Southwest 783, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, clear to land, Southwest 783. Southwest 1151, pushback approved. Expect runway 1 right. Ground. One right pushback approved. So, um, Southwest 1151. Yeah, if you've got other questions about the, the airports, I would not buy San Francisco. It's broken. I would avoid San Diego. It's Tower. got some Southwest little knucklehead issues because these are early airports. And uh, the reason why I say San Francisco is broken is because at SFO, the runways are on 750 foot center lines, which modern runways are on much wider center lines. So you can have simultaneous flight operations, okay? But it's San Francisco, because of the landlocked situation when they built the airport, the runways are much closer together. Now, they have a workaround for the rules with FAA that if you're coming in on the two approaches over the water, airplanes can actually line up off of each other's wing if they're flying VFR, visual flight rules, conditions. And they can land simultaneously. Ground. The, Southwest the 1151 trip ready is to taxi. Southwest 1151 runway one right at Bravo via Golf Whiskey Delta. Runway one right at Bravo via Golf Whiskey Delta Southwest 1151. Now let's watch let's watch where this guy stops. Oh, he's gonna clear Alpha 8, so he's gonna have to go way up here. But see, he's in nobody's way. Oh he did oh he made the turn. Awesome. <laughs> way to go, dude. It was like a Cessna. You know, these things suck. 6030 Zulu taxi to ramp via Bravo Hotel. Taxi to ramp via Bravo Hotel 6030 Zulu. 6030 Zulu, hold short of taxiway Charlie 1. Hold short of taxiway Charlie 1. Why did I give him that Zulu. command? Okay, so let me let me explain what I just did because this is one of the nuances of the game you didn't know. Yeah, I'll go back to let me um, go back to SFO in a minute because it's the way the game operates versus how they operate the airport in real life. Okay. Um, they have two parallel crossing runways, right? They'll do departures off of the, of two of them and do simultaneous landings off of the other two. The simultaneous landings, the planes come in off the wing tips of each other, basically at 700 foot spacing. Your the FAA minimum technically is like a thousand foot spacing. Okay. Now, and so what happens is when they land, they have to cross those two parallel or perpendicular active runways. In the game, they'll go full stop about the time they get to those runways and it slows down everything. There's high speed turnoffs, but one of them, if you're landing on the left runway, and I forget the numerical designation of the, the hang on, let me see. Stupid All right, let's see. SFO, Air Nav. Oh, Air Nav will do. All right, so here's the airport diagram. All right, they typically at, at SFO do arrivals on. I don't want to download the PDF. Just show me the picture. Oh, you guys suck. Are you serious? I do not want to can't quite see the um, runway designations. You come in over the water, and typically the approach is actually coming over the city, and then they turn 180 degrees. Oh, son of a B. The guy turns sideways on me. Okay, so the arrivals are on the 2.8s. So they'll do landings on 2.8 left, 2.8 right, and they'll do departures on... tilt my screen here <laughs> oh no oh, okay here we go i got it all right there i figured it out one right okay so they do departures on the ones all right and then the terminal is actually in the armpit between one left and two eight left okay so it's in the corner so you got dual parallel runways that cross each other planes come in and land on two eight two right in real life though they'll actually make sure they coast out and cross the ones at a little bit of speed 
typically an aircraft can turn off onto a high speed uh, taxiway at about 40, 50 knots, and then they break. Okay, they've done most of their slowing down, and at that point, they just use their brakes and they can stop fairly quickly because they've got like these huge brakes. All right, so aircraft landing on 28 left will turn off at X ray, aircraft landing on 28 right will turn off at Tango unless it's big jets coming in like A380s or um, maybe 777s. They'll turn off down at Quebec, okay? The point is they get their asses across the active ones because as soon as they clear the ones, there's a guy in the tower watching. Is like, okay, you on one right, clear for takeoff. You on one left, clear for takeoff. Now, those two planes then firewall and they haul ass and they clear the actives and then they take off over the bay. But as part of the um, air nav and the, the instructions and stuff, whatever it is, once they take off, the aircraft on one right makes a right-hand turn like 20 degrees, and then the aircraft on one left makes a left-hand turn like 20 degrees, and that gives them proper separation heading away from each other. And then they start climbing up, and then they contact departure, and they do their thing. So the issue with KSFO in the game is... It doesn't do that. First off, you can't put the planes that close together on the approach, which means you can't fly the field prototypically. Second, when aircraft land on this thing, they slow down to taxi speed, and then they coast up until the turnoff. As you'll notice here at Vegas, most of the 737s are down to speed by Alpha 6, Alpha 5, and then they're just putting along and they turn off at alpha four. They should be rolling in there about 30 to 40 knots, not 10 knots, okay? Get your ass off my active, and then we'll talk. Hey, Veronica, how are you? Well, hell, <laughs> hell, Miss 69 Chargers here to bring the chat, boys. <laughs> yeah, now the chat's lively today, girl. I appreciate you being here, though. Hope you're having a great day. Uh, so... That's part one of the deficiencies with the game is the aircraft Tower, slowing down southwest five five eight with you runway eight right so much before they actually um, turn off the active instead of rolling out and then turning off the active then breaking, which is what they should do. Southwest two one two eight pushback approved expect runway one right. Negative. Southwest two one two eight. Okay, now what just happened there is if you watch at the top, the voice recognition will spell out what I'm saying to the pilot, okay? And what happened was you push the shift key to transmit, but you hold the shift key down, all right? And then you release it when you're done with whatever you're saying. If you release it just a touch early, sometimes the pilots will say, eh, I don't think so, all right? So that's what just happened. Southwest 2128, pushback approved. Expect runway one right. Ground. One right push back so I just need to make sure that that Southwest one two, right one, two, eight. Uh, Spirit came up on the screen, requesting push and, start. and that means it's done. Now, so we've got guys coming out of the same terminal. Now, I just gave this southwest plane permission to push. If we look here, we've got two gates between them, but because this is Vegas and this is an early airport, sometimes you can have some wonky stuff happen with the pushbacks, and I'm going to let southwest push, and I'm going to get him out of the alleyway. See, he's on the move now. I'm going to get him out of the alleyway, and then we'll push uh, Spirit Wings. Uh, let's check our arrivals here on the strip. Southwest 558 needs to be cleared in. Southwest 558, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, clear Speaking to land. Speaking of San Francisco, five, five, he's coming in from KSFO. Now, let's talk about 6030 Zulu, because I brought this up. When I gave him a command, because he stopped at Alpha 8, which was super awesome. I Ground. said taxi. Southwest 2128, ready to taxi. Oh, good, good. Southwest 2128, runway one right at Bravo via Golf Whiskey Delta. And see, Runway it right spells Bravo, out Golf Whiskey Delta, up in the, the, the commands. Uh, can you use text? Uh, you, you can tap. All right, so I'll do this next. So let this guy get moving, and then I'll show you how that works. But 6030 Zulu, I gave him a command to taxi to Trump to ramp, because he's actually just going to ramp. He's going to GA. Via Bravo Hotel. Okay, so that's easy enough. But then I gave him a command saying, hold short of taxiway Charlie 1. Well, if you look, Charlie 1 is actually way over here. 
Why did you give him that command, A-Train? Because that means it clears him across the actives, and he will not stop until he gets to Charlie 1. It clears him across the actives. So otherwise, uh, he would stop prior to one right, and I'd have to say continue to axing, then he'd stop prior to one left, and then he'd stop, and I'd have to clear him again. By saying hold short of taxiway Charlie 1, which is way out of the way, just because like Delta and some of these things wrap around goofy places, so I gave him something way over here. He zipped right across, and now he's out of my way, out of my hair, and out of my life. All right, now, Southwest 2234 has got a taxi to terminal, right? So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do this with the GUI, okay? I click on the airplane. It pulls it up. Taxi to terminal, okay? Now, it's going to pick its path, which it's going to go across Alpha 4. It should pick Charlie, and then depending on where its gate is, it will take whatever. We're playing Tower 3D uh, Pro there, Veronica. For a few more minutes, then I'm going to wrap up. This has actually gone longer than I intended. Uh, but we're having a good time, and we're doing some awesome work here at uh, Las Vegas. All right, now, there's two commands I could give to... Oh, wait, I've got to hit send. Taxi to Terminal Southwest 2234. Now, okay, so let's look at this. This is what he generated with what I just gave him. He's going to go across Alpha 4 to Bravo... Then go down to Charlie 5, then take a right, then take a left on Charlie, then go up to Whiskey, arc around Whiskey, go up Golf, and then turn into his terminal. Now, a deficiency of this version of the game, and I hope they correct this in the new one, is they should tell you what gate they're going to prior to landing. When they call in, you should get an indication on what gate they're going to, and you don't. So you don't know where. You'll see that it's going to be one of these gates, but you don't know which one. Therefore, you don't know what taxiway to tell them to take until you tell them a taxiway to take. Then you can change it. Does that make sense? Hey, Veronica, if you would, give me some peanut butter M&Ms, please. Thank you. <laughs> I ate the ones I had. I've still got two bags of uh, dark chocolate mint ones, though. So, All right, now. So here's what I'm going to do. I don't want him going that way. Now, I've got options. The way I'm operating the airport right now, I don't have anything in his way. I have been sending them down Charlie. He can take Charlie all the way to golf, golf up here, and then turn into the, the uh, alleyway. That's the smart way to do this. Southwest 2234, taxi to terminal via Charlie Golf. Now, taxi to terminal via Charlie Golf, Southwest 2234. You'll see, yeah, see the path changed. Now, I'm going to push Spirit Wings back. And I'm going to use the GUI to do it. So I click on the airplane, push back, runway, one right. Okay? And send. Ground, one right, push back, approve. Spirit Wings 188. Okay? That's how it works. Southwest, Southwest 1151, wind is 25 at 3 knots, runway, one right, clear for takeoff. Wind is 25 at 3 knots, runway, one right, cleared for it's takeoff. It's much easier Southwest to do with voice than it is with clicking on stuff. So, uh, and then you can see here Southwest 558 is coming in from San Francisco. And you learn all the airport codes too, which is a lot of fun. So SNA is Orange County, Santa Ana, John Wayne. Goes by all three names. Orange County, California. Santa Ana, California. And it's John Wayne International. Um. KDAL is Dallas Love Field, San Francisco's home hub. And then KSFO is the aforementioned San Francisco. Now, see how 2234 stopped at the active. Okay, so that's what they'll do. Ground. Spirit Wings 188 ready to taxi. If I had given him the command to hold short somewhere, he'd have just crossed right over and then kept go, going. Yeah, but you you have to get the base game first. You can't just buy the uh, the add-ons. You have to you have to start with the base game. So you got to get Tower 3D Pro, get real traffic, real color. Well, you don't have to get real color for it, but I would because so many of the base airplanes are on there. Okay? Does that make sense? Yeah, get the base package, then get you, get you Sky Harbor. Sky Harbor is okay. It's got three runways to work with. It's interesting. Spare Wings 188, runway one right at Bravo via Golf, Whiskey, Delta. 
Runway now, one right at Bravo via golf there are some Delta specific Spirit commands uh, that you can do also. Southwest 2234, continue taxi. Continue taxi, Southwest 2234. Now, watch, I'm going to give Southwest 783, see, it's going to this terminal. I'm going to give Tower, them a similar Allegiant command. 5, 9, or 8, requesting push and start. Southwest 783, taxi to terminal via Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Charlie Southwest See, 783. he figured out by me telling him Charlie to go to golf and up that same alleyway. Southwest 783, hold short of taxiway golf 2. Hold short of taxiway golf 2, Southwest 783. Now, that command, hold short of golf 2, golf 2 is here. It's beyond where he's going. That will clear him across the active, and then he'll just keep rolling. The only stipulation there is if I have an airplane pop up here and I push in front of him, these pilots aren't the brightest in the world. They may crash into it. Southwest 1151, contact Vegas Departure 12549 or good morning. Roger, good morning. But that way the airplane gets moving and keeps moving. Southwest 558, taxi to terminal via Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Charlie, so Southwest 558. He's going to assume the same route. Southwest 558, hold short of taxiway Charlie 5. Hold short of taxiway Charlie 5, Southwest 558. Now Charlie 5 is here. That's if I have an airplane pop up here or here, he'll stop before that taxiway in case I get, you know, a departure pop up here in a minute. And that way I've got him good to go. He's going to stop. The departure is more my priority. I've already got my points for the arrival. You get 10 points per landing, 10 points per takeoff. Southwest 2128, wind is 25 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, clear for takeoff. Wind is 25 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, cleared for takeoff, Southwest 2128. All right. So, tower, executive six four eight with you runway eight right. Oh, exec yet. Now watch this. This is going to throw throw you throw you for a bit of a loop. Check this out. Exec yet six four eight. Enter final runway one left. Enter final runway one left. Exec yet six four eight. Exec yet six four eight. Runway one left. Clear to land. Runway 1 left cleared to land executive 648. So I'm actually going to swing him around and put him in on this runway. See that? I'm turning it on and off. So that's going to put him in on this runway because he's going to go either to this. Actually, he should come down here. So this guy's parading in. This guy's parading in. This guy's parading in. They're all going the same alley. Allegiant 5, 9, or 8. Pushback approved. Expect runway 1 right. Ground. One right pushback approved. Excuse Allegiant me. five nine or eight. So if you noticed earlier, the little Cessna looking dude who just dropped off, I put him in on the left runway, which is the, the departure runway, but it's easier to control. Fortunately, I didn't have anybody sitting at Alpha eight at the time, or that'd have been a problem. But I could have said exit at taxiway Alpha six, and he'd have turned off down here. Okay, so that's some things you can. Exert control, take next available exit on left, take next available exit on right, things like that. You want to get something challenging because what you'll get is uh, with the base game with Philadelphia and then with LAX, all the, runway, un, all the runways are parallel. Now there's a crosswind runway at Philadelphia, but what's stupid is Philly was an, uh, a U.S. Airways hub. And they have a lot Ground. of Airbus A321s, which taxi. suck because they're underpowered. The A321 Neo just gets it up to power. Spirit Wings 188, runway. Actually, hang on. I'm going to give him this full command here. Spirit Wings 188, wind is 25 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, clear for takeoff. Wind is 25 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, cleared for takeoff. Spirit Wings 188. Southwest 2128, contact Vegas Departure 12549 or good morning. Roger. Good morning. Allegiant 598, runway 1 right at Bravo via Golf 2, Zulu, Whiskey, Delta. Runway 1 right at Bravo via Golf 2, Zulu, Whiskey, Delta, Allegiant 598. Now, notice how I enunciated each of those with a brief pause in between. It's just the way to do this. It's just be smooth, enunciate. Everything will run nicely. Sometimes you'll get some drop stuff. And it's, just, it's, it's a little practice when it comes to doing the voice stuff. Southwest 558, five, continue taxi. Continue see, taxi, so he Southwest hit my, five, he hit my five, control eight. point. Now, if you guys want to see stuff here, let me see. Uh, 
There's a Hawaiian Airlines flight here. I don't see anybody with their lights on over here. There's Sun Country, there's United, American, American, Air Canada, which is probably a Maple flight. There's a Frontier flight. Uh, no, you you won't suck. No, don't worry about it, dude. But trust me, you it, it just takes a little practice, and you'll figure it out. And um, the, and if you have questions, get on Discord. Ask me. I have hundreds of hours of this game videos available on my uh, on my channel here. I just haven't done a lot of it in the past year. So, turn the eight ears back on. We can see. Spirit Wings taking off. Uh, I would advise having a notebook and you write down these codes until you memorize them. SWA, Southwest, that's kind of an easy one. But AAY, Allegiant, eh, that's a little bit. Um, NKS, Spirit Wings, eh, wait a minute, what's that? Um, you'll get a lot of Southwest traffic into Sky Harbor and a lot of American traffic because that was an America West, America Worst hub. And now, of course, they joined with a with U.S. Airways, and now they're a part of American. So it's still Phoenix Sky Harbor has become more of an American hub because they took over America Worst, which is why you'll get a lot of Airbus jets in and out of there. A three twenty ones are the worst; they need the longest runway to take off and land. Um, if you're not familiar, the A three twenty is an American is is an amazing Airbus airplane. It's it's the equivalent of a seven thirty seven. And what they did was they built a short version of it called the A319, which sucks because legroom is non-existent and I'm 6'3". But then they did a stretch version called the A321. But it's the same engines. And it's got longer range. I think they put a little bigger wing on it. It's got a longer range, but it takes longer for those engines to get it up to speed, take off, and get it stopped. So, not a fan of the A321. The A321neo, though, is a good airplane. Spirit Wings 188, contact Vegas Departure 12549 or good morning. Roger, good morning. Allegiant 598, wind is 24 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, cleared for takeoff. Wind is 24 at 3 knots, runway 1 so right. So then up here at the top, you've got the lights on and off at the airport. You just click those on and off. This is your speed control. You can do 2 times speed, 4 times 8 times 16. Tower. United 1287 requesting this, push and start. This turning the camera on will zoom in on the aircraft. United 1287, push back approved. Expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, push back approved. Now, if you United see airplanes around with their uh, lights, their nav lights on, like this American plane, it's going to push soon. It's going to call in here in, uh, in the next few minutes. That's how you can tell. Now, this, fortunately, this exec jet. It, it sounds like you're saying exec yet. Tower, Frontier Flight 1679 or with you runway 8 right. It's it's executive jet, exec jet. So. Frontier Flight 1679 or runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway this is an right, Airbus A320 coming in from KMCO, Mickey's Round. corporate office, United which is in Orlando, Florida. I have that airport as well. That's a big Southwest time too. United 1287, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Charlie 5, Bravo. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Charlie 5, Bravo, United 1287. Tower, so American 677 requesting push and you start. Can turn the 8 ears on and off, which is your ground radar system. And then you can turn the D-Bright off, which is your airborne radar system. And then you can turn the strip on and off, which is your strip. <laughs> Yeah, MCO is Mickey's corporate office. That's one of the air, uh, airports they have. KPHL, American 6... six. Okay, so here. Here's an example. Okay, I was just talking about this. Funny how that works. American 677 is an Airbus A321. Uh, going from Vegas, KLAS, to KPHL, which is filthy, Philadelphia. And there we go. There's an A321. This is a former U.S. Airways aircraft that's going to fly from Vegas to filthy. American 677, pushback approved, expect runway Alpha 8. That was dumb. American 677, pushback approved, expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, pushback approved. American 677. Yeah, if you guys go in the general chit chat, 
You can check out Veronica's charger because it's the shizzle. Tower, Frontier Flight 771 with you, runway 8 right. All right, so Frontier Flight 771 is an Airbus A319 coming in from Denver. Allegiant 5 9 or 8, contact Vegas departure 12549 or good morning. Roger, good morning. Now, the good thing here is Execute is, although it's slowing down, Frontier Flight, these are five mile rings. It's still 14 miles out. And it's going to start slowing down here once it hits about the 10 mile mark. So the timing on this will work out nicely. Now I'm going to give the front now the exec yet. I've got to give it a, a uh, I'm going to give it a command here that you don't normally give. Oh yeah, they have triple sevens and so oh yeah. Uh, in fact, here at Vegas, you'll see a British Airways Speedbird, um, either seven four seven four hundred or occasionally they'll have a triple seven. As they fly, uh, they fly out of uh, Vegas to Heathrow and to London Gatwick. Execute six four eight. Take next available exit on left. Take next available exit on left. Execute six four eight. So American two four one. This way he doesn't get goofy and, and turn right off the runway onto Taxiway Echo, which I can deal with. It's no big deal, but whatever. All right, we got some American planes calling in now. This guy looks like he's on the pimple and pushing back finally. Push you back, push you back, way back. Tower, Southwest 189 or 3 with you, runway 8 right. American 2411 is a 737-700 with the engines that like to explode going from Vegas to Miami. Da -da, da -da, Miami. Do -do. American 2411, push back approved. Expect runway 8 left. Ground. Eight left push back. Here's approved. our executive arrival. American 2411. Yay, he's done and out of the way. Hooray and huzzah. Now, on the strip here, you see the check mark. That means I've given him a command. Frontier Flight 771, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, clear to land. Frontier Flight 771. Southwest 189 or 3, runway 8 right, clear to land. Uh, okay, right you want cargo? <laughs> yes, you will get UPS and FedEx, not in Vegas. Um, if you want to do FedEx fun, I have videos of KMEM, which is Memphis, which is their worldwide international hub. And they have four rush hours per day, two arrival rush and two departure rush. Uh, yeah, so if you want to do cargo, KMEM is the place to be. You'll get cargo flights into uh, SeaTac, LAX, um, DFW. Mm, Philly. Ground. American six seven seven ready to taxi. You'll get you'll get him in Tower. several places. Southwest four eight nine or zero with you runway eight right. All right, so he should turn left there, and he is okay. So I don't know which way he's going Ground. until I call. American two four one one ready to taxi. American two four one one runway eight left at Alpha eight via Charlie five, Bravo. Runway eight left at Alpha eight via Charlie five, Bravo. American two four one one. American six seven seven runway eight left. Tower. American 2289 are requesting push and Rude. start. American 677, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo, American 677. Execute 648, taxi to ramp via hotel. Taxi to ramp via hotel, Executive yeah, so 648. Yeah, see, he's going down there. Um, and here's that American plane we were talking about. American 2289 are pushback approved. Expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, pushback approved. American 2289er. Southwest 489 0, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, clear to land, Southwest 489 0. So I right click and drag, and that moves these uh, tags around. So now we're going into another little rush segment here. United 1287. United 1287, wind is 23 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. Wind is two three at three knots. Runway now eight left. Now the only thing I don't United want one, two, eight, here, seven. and it's not going to occur because Frontier flights United about to be seven zero seven with you. Runway eight right. Is you don't want this plane taking off and another plane landing right next to him. Now if there's a thousand feet between the runways, you'll be safe. At Philadelphia, you can get penalized. Ground. American two two eight nine are ready to taxi. KSDF. Uh, no, it is not. Not to not to my knowledge. No, the, if you want cargo action, you want Memphis.
America 2289er, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Charlie 6, Bravo. Oops, hang on. American 2289er, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Charlie 5, Bravo. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 by Charlie 5, Bravo, American 2289er. Yeah, it's, 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 okay, but here's the thing. Here's the trick to Memphis. You've got to be very careful. Um, and you know what? If you want to see something crazy here, hang on, I'm going to pause this because I actually have this available where I can show you guys. Here is a picture. This is from uh, ADSB, uh, the website. This is what traffic looks like going into Memphis during rush hour arrival. And the flight operations, I believe, are going into the north. So the aircraft are all coming in, and then they turn, and then they loop around, and then they go back to the north to land on the 1-8s. There's three north-south runways. There's one east-west runway. All of the FedEx facilities at Memphis are north of that east-west runway except for one little ramp. And then there's a little UPS ramp, too. And then the passenger terminals between the 1-8 uh, left and 1-8 center, or 3-6 left, 3-6 center runways. So it's really interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it, it is. It, it is. Believe me, you'll have 60 to 80 active aircraft at a time. It's insane. And you've got to be very careful because they didn't get the spacing and the scaling right. And if you have an alleyway where maybe you have an MD-11 that's just pushed back to taxi out and another MD-11 in front of them becomes active, it'll it'll clip and you'll wind up with a 500 or a thousand point penalty so that's what uh, stuff can look like at uh, at memphis it's pretty insane very very uh active very busy uh and it is an advanced user airport just like uh, dfw is if you're if you're flying it like you should which is uh six to seven active runways all right let's resume here and we'll see what's a hopping in hot stuff Frontier Flight 1679er Taxi to Terminal via Alpha 4 Charlie. Taxi to Terminal via Alpha 4 Charlie Frontier Flight 1679er. Uh, Frontier Flight 1679er Taxi to Terminal via Alpha 4 Bravo Charlie 3 Charlie 7. Taxi to Terminal via Alpha 4 Bravo Charlie 3 Charlie 7 Frontier Flight 1679er. Tower, Sky West 4935 with you runway 8 right. United 707. Runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, clear to land, United 707. Skywest 4935, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, clear to land, Skywest 4935. Frontier Flight 1679, hold short of taxiway Charlie 6. Hold short of taxiway Charlie 6, That will get him Frontier across the active and all the way into his gate without, I don't have to talk to him again. He's done, unless something pops up in the way and I just won't have them push. It looks like the Hawaiian Airlines flight's getting ready to uh, light up here shortly. It looks like they're getting catering. Hey, Virgilius, have a good night. Appreciate you. I'll talk to you soon. United 1287, contact Vegas departure 125.9er. See ya. Roger. Good day. Now we're in the good day. After 9 a.m., you're in the good day. Frontier Flight 771, taxi to terminal via Alpha 4, Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 Charlie Frontier Flight 771. Frontier Flight 771, taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 Bravo Charlie 3. Taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 Bravo Charlie 3 Frontier Flight 771. Now, if you catch the aircraft, so uh, you can give them a, a taxi command to the terminal once, uh, I mean, and sometimes even before they touch down to try to catch where their gate is because what I could have done in this case was said, Frontier Flight 771, exit at taxiway Alpha 3, which would have had them roll out longer. But I do have a Southwest plane about to come in over the, the threshold. And because of the slow taxi speeds, that could be a pain. But he would have rolled out to Alpha 3, and then it would have been a straight shot across to Charlie 3 and into his gate. So, eh, it is what it is. You got to kind of work within the restrictions of the game. So I'm hoping they correct that on the, the new version. Tower. Southwest 375 with you, runway 8 right. Plus, you should be able to slow the aircraft down or speed the aircraft up within certain 
uh, limits. Like you should be able to slow them down to 200. You should be able to speed them up to you know 240, 250, I think. And uh, you can't do that with this version. So Southwest 375, runway eight right, clear to land. Runway eight right, clear to land, Southwest 375. Frontier flight 771, hold short of taxiway, Charlie one. Hold short of taxiway, Charlie one, Frontier flight 771. So he should get moving, go straight across and go straight to his gate. Southwest 1893, taxi to terminal via Alpha 4, Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Alpha 4, go, Charlie, Southwest 1893. Go the gate. American 2411, runway 8 left, line up and wait. Do not want runway to get him left, line up and wait. American 2411. American 2411, runway 8 left, line up and wait. Runway 8 left, line up and wait. American 2411. I want to make sure he got the command right. Because sometimes you'll hear him say, and wait. Or they'll say, line up. But they won't catch the full command. I want to make sure it's right. The payoff for a successful takeoff and landing is only 10 points. The payoff for a mistake is 500 to 1,000 points. And that goes on your permanent record in the game. Unless Tower. you delete that. Delta 2217 requesting push and start. Delta 2217 pushback approved. Expect runway 8 left. Ground. Eight left pushback approved. Delta 2217. American 677. Runway 1 left at Bravo. Runway 1 left at that Bravo. American 677. Oops. American 677. Runway 1 left at. Okay, there. Commit clear. American 677. Runway 1 right at Bravo. Runway 1 right at Bravo, American 677. Tower, American 2537 with you, runway 8 right. American 2411, wind is 23 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. Wind is 23 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, cleared for takeoff, American 2411. American 677, runway 1 right, line up and wait. Ground, Delta 2217 ready to taxi. Runway 1 right, line up and wait, American 677. You should get moving again here. Yep. American 2289er, runway... Eight left, line up and wait. Runway eight left, line up and wait. American two two eight nine er. Southwest four eight nine er zero. Taxi to terminal via Alpha four Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Alpha four Charlie. Southwest four eight nine er zero. Delta two two one seven. Runway eight left at Alpha eight via Charlie five Bravo. Runway eight left at Alpha eight via Charlie five Bravo. Delta two two one seven. Southwest one eight nine er three. Continue taxi. Continue Once this airplane takes off, you can clear the sky across the active. Now, it takes them a few seconds to get going, but that way you you won't have a conflict and get penalized. American 677, wind is 23 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, clear for takeoff. Wind is 23 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, cleared for takeoff, American 677. American 2411, contact Vegas departure 12549er, see ya. Roger, good day. Tower. Southwest 3290 requesting push and start. Okay, so he's coming in. He's good. He's rolling out. He's good. See, I split that up there because we've got so many arrivals coming in now. It's one less plane to have to get across the active. Now, as soon as this guy is across the active, we're going to clear 2289er for departure. He's going to be rolling here in a second. American 2289er, wind is 23 at 3 knots. Runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. Wind is 23 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, cleared for takeoff, American 2289er. So you're going to have this plane now, he's punching burners, this guy's turning on, he's going to punch it. American 2537, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, cleared to land, American 2537. This guy should scoot across, then get out of the way. It's going to be a little bit close, I just got to watch it. So the only thing is here, you got to be careful if you give these guys a command to continue, you know, to taxi to because you don't want them encroaching on the active when you have a plane taken off. So this guy just cut right across. He's good to go. Plenty of room. Tower. Sky zoom West zoom. 4602 requesting push and start. Bada bing ski, bada boom ski. United 707 taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 Bravo. Taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 Bravo United 707. United 707 taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 Charlie Charlie 5. Taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 Charlie Charlie 5 United 707. Now, as soon as this guy, that Southwest 489 or 0, continue taxi. 
Okay. 2289er. See how long it took him to get off the ground? That's an A321. Tower. That's a problem. Delta 187 Southwest 4890. Continue taxi. Continue taxi southwest 4890. United 707, hold short of taxiway Charlie 6. Hold short of taxiway Charlie 6, United 707. That'll keep him moving. American 677, contact Vegas departure 12549er. Good day. Roger. Good day. American 2289er, contact Vegas departure 125.9er. See ya. Roger. He's Good heading day. to DFW. Awesome. Now these two Tower. guys are going to roll Executive across the active. Executive requesting push and start. Okay. So this guy's coming out, this guy's coming in. This guy's on the same alleyway. I can push him back, though. He should be okay. Southwest 3290, pushback approved. Expect runway one right. Ground, one right, pushback approved. Southwest 3290. I don't know where the hell he's going. Executive 377, pushback approved. Expect runway one left. Ground, one left, pushback approved. He's not going Executive that way. Executive 377. I'll show you how my guy did that in. This guy made a slow landing here, and now this guy's rolling in behind him. But he'll be okay. Skywest 4935, taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 Bravo. Taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 okay. Bravo, Skywest 4935. Skywest 4935, taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 Charlie, Charlie 5. Taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 Charlie, Charlie 5, Skywest 4935. Skywest 4935, hold short of taxiway Charlie 6. Hold short of taxiway Charlie 6, Skywest 4935. Delta 1872, runway 8 right, clear to land. Runway 8 right, clear to land, Check Delta 1872. Check them clearance to land. Tower. So you see down here, wings four four push back push and, start. and designated runway. And if we change it, it lines through and then it says something different. Skywest 4602, push back approved, expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, push back approved. Skywest 4602. Ground, Southwest 3290, ready to taxi. Spirit Wings 446, pushback approved. Ground, Executive 377, ready to taxi. Executive 377, runway 1 left at Bravo via hotel. Runway 1 left at Bravo via hotel, Executive 377. Okay, I'm going to let this guy, he's going to sit until this guy pulls in to his gate. Spirit Wings 446, pushback approved, expect runway 1 left. <laughs> nope. I just hold the button down and then I wait till it deletes. If you hit the clear button, Tower. it won't Southwest clear. You only need to hit like four or five and times and it won't clear it. You just have to wait. Ground, Skywest 4602 ready to taxi. Now see, we're looking right here at these guys. And let's just turn your eight ears off. There he's turning in. He's good to go. Southwest 32900, runway one right at Bravo via Golf Whiskey Delta. Runway one right at Bravo via Golf Whiskey Delta, Southwest 32900. Spirit Wings 446, pushback approved, expect runway one right. Ground, one right, pushback approved. Yeah, that was Spirit worse. Wings 446. He's out of the way. Southwest 375, taxi to terminal via Alpha 4, Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 Charlie Southwest 375. Delta 2217 runway 8 left line up and wait. Runway 8 left line up and wait Delta 2217. Skywest 4602 runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Charlie 3 Bravo. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Charlie 3 Bravo Skywest 4602. American 2537 taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 Charlie American 2537. American 2537, taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 Charlie, Charlie 3. Taxi to terminal via Alpha 4 Charlie, Charlie 3, American 2537. There's a, so we got a Southwest flight. Ground, come, Spirit uh, Wings 446, ready to taxi. Uh, Phoenix Sky Harbor. We got one that's coming from ORD, uh, American flight. That's from Chicago O'Hare. And CVG is Cincinnati. Delta 2217, wind is 22 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. Wind is 22 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, cleared for takeoff, Delta 2217. Southwest 3699, or pushback approved, expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, pushback approved. Southwest 3699. Southwest 3290, runway 1 right, line up and wait. 
runway one right line up and waits out west three two nine or zero. Spirit wings four four six runway one right at Bravo via Bravo six Bravo. Runway one right at Bravo via Bravo six Bravo Spirit wings four four six. Mm, what do we got going here? What's the problem? What's the problem? What's the problem, people? What's the hold up? United seven zero seven continue taxi. Continue taxi United seven zero seven. Get on your gate. You're holding up the parade there, dork. Okay, so Del Delta's off the deck right now. I'm going to, because we only got one more arrival coming in behind him. We'll hold these guys for a minute. Delta 2217, contact Vegas departure. 12549 or see ya. Roger, good day. Ground, Southwest 369er ready to taxi. Southwest 369er, Niner, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo Southwest 369er, Niner. Southwest 369er, Niner, runway 8. Eight left via Bravo Five Bravo. Shoot. Southwest three six nine or nine runway eight left at Alpha Eight via Bravo Five Bravo. Runway eight left at Alpha Eight via Bravo Five Bravo Should Southwest three six nine or nine. Yep, there we go. Perfect. And that's not labeled. Sometimes you have to kind of guesstimate what this is. Southwest 375, continue taxi. Continue taxi, Southwest 375. Skywest 4935, continue taxi. Continue taxi, Skywest 4935. Southwest 3290, wind is 2238. Southwest 3290, wind is 22 at 3 knots, runway 1 right. Clear for takeoff. Wind is 22 at 3 knots, runway 1 right cleared for takeoff, southwest 3290. Executive 377, runway 1 left, line up and wait. Runway 1 left, line up and wait, executive 377. American 2537, hold short of taxiway Charlie 2. Tower, Allegiant 532 requesting push and start. Now, I gave him that hold command short of before he Charlie stops. Two, American 2537. Otherwise, you have to give him a continue taxi. And then, hey, what's happening there, Blakey? Yeah, we got uh, Farm Sim coming up here in a little bit. Uh, we've had a lot of questions about uh, Tower 3D Pro, and we run this session longer than I intended to, and that's all good because people are interested in the game, and if I can help people get interested in the game or better understand it or improve their purchase decision knowledge, then uh, that's something we definitely want to do. Customer service, good thing on my part. Spirit Wings 4, 4, 6, Runway 1 right, line up and wait. Runway 1 right, line up and wait, Spirit Wings 4, 4, 6. Allegiant 5, 3, 2, push back approved, expect Runway 1 right. Ground, 1 right, push back approved. Allegiant 5, 3, 2. These two guys are kind of playing grab butt as they head out. Delta 1872, taxi to terminal via Alpha 4, Charlie. Taxi to terminal via Alpha 4, Charlie, Delta 1872. Delta 1872, hold short of taxiway, Charlie 3. Tower, so again, Southwest 3, that's over here. Requesting push and start. So he'll go Old across the active Charlie 3, Delta 1, 8, without 7, stopping, and then he'll just drive on up there. He'll be good to go. So now, this guy's going to this ramp. This guy's clear out, so I can push him. Southwest 3, 8, 1, 9, or pushback approved. Expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, pushback approved. Southwest 3, 8, 1, 9, Southwest 3, 2, 9, or 0. Contact Vegas departure, 1, 2, 5, 4, 9, or good day. Roger, good day. All right, so now that he's out of here, Executive 377, wind is 22 at 3 knots, runway 1 left, clear for takeoff. Wind is 22 at 3 knots, runway 1 left, so cleared for takeoff, Executive 377. As well. Southwest 36999, runway 8 left, line up and wait. Runway 8 left, line up and wait, Southwest 36999. Ground. Allegiant 532 ready to taxi. Allegiant 532 runway 1 right at Bravo via Golf Whiskey Delta. Runway 1 right at Bravo via Golf Whiskey Delta. Allegiant 532. Ground. Southwest 3819 ready to taxi. Southwest 3819 or runway 8. Southwest 3819 or runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo 4 Bravo. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo 4 Bravo Southwest 3819 er All right. We got any other questions about this? You seeing kind of how this is you're picking up what I'm putting down here, people? I've done this a time or two. But running the airport this way is not the normal way you do it. Normally, you're arriving planes in on 2-6 left, 
and departing them on 26 right. Now, if you get like the uh, Speedbird 747s, you need the whole runway. So I'd have to send him all the way down to 8 left. And then just be careful as I did other stuff. So yeah, it'd be cool. Execute 377, contact Vegas, departure 12549er. See ya. Roger, good day. Tower, Southwest 1155, requesting push and start. Now, um, I could push him, but I don't want to push him tail in front of 3819er. So, Southwest 369er, Niner, wind is 22 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. Wind is 22 at 3 knots, runway 8 left, cleared for takeoff, Southwest 369er, Niner. Yep, he's done it out of the way. Now it's quieted down again. Yay. Once this guy takes the turn, then I'll push this guy. He's good. Spirit Wings 446, wind is 22 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, clear for takeoff. Wind is 22 at 3 knots, runway 1 right, cleared for takeoff, Spirit Wings 446. Skywest 4602, runway 8 left, line up and wait. Runway 8 left, line up and wait, Skywest 4602. Southwest 1155, pushback approved, expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, pushback approved. See, Southwest the game 1155. They're going to go to the end of the runway. Nope. smarter than that. Southwest 369er Niner is going to BNA. Is that... It's not Burbank. That's BUR. That's BNA. Nashville. Okay. Cool. Nice little airport they have there. One thing I, I wish they'd done with this too, and they didn't, um, there's no military aircraft. And that kind of sucks. Uh, because like Phoenix Sky Harbor has a KC-135 reserve wing or squadron there. So it'd be cool to kind of have them in there sometimes. Um, Memphis has military aircraft. Uh, a couple of the other airports. Not very many, but some of them do. Spare Wings 446, contact Vegas departure 125.9 or good day. Roger. Good day. Southwest 369er, Niner. Contact Vegas departure. See ya. Roger. Good day. Skywest 4602. Wind is 22 at 3 knots. Runway 8 left. Clear for takeoff. Wind is 22 at 3 knots. Runway 8 left. Cleared for takeoff. Skywest 4602. Ground. Southwest 1155. Ready to taxi. Southwest 1155. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Charlie 5. Bravo. Oops. Nope. Southwest 1155, runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo 5, Bravo. Runway 8 left at Alpha 8 via Bravo 5, Bravo See, Southwest so 1155. Here you have Bravo 4, right? And here's Alpha 5. This is Whiskey, but this is Bravo 6 and then Bravo 7. The logical assumption is this then is Bravo 5, this alleyway. Okay? So if you can kind of figure that out, and sometimes like Boston, you have to pull up the uh, map on like a screen uh, to learn which some of the not every one of the taxiways is labeled that's my point all right but if you can learn those and the game will accept it like it did you Tower. have more control United 704 requesting push and start Legion 532 wind is 22 or 3 knots runway 1 right click for takeoff wind is 22 or 3 knots runway 1 right cleared for takeoff Allegiant 532 United 704 push back approved expect runway 8 left United 704, pushback approved. Expect runway 8 left. Ground, 8 left, pushback approved. United 704. Southwest 3819er, wind is 22 at 3 knots. Runway 8 left, clear for takeoff. It's going to Austin, wind Bergstrom is International. Knots, left, cleared for takeoff, Southwest 3819er. Skywest 4602, contact departure. Good day. Tower, Skywest 4518 with you, runway 8 right. Roger, good day. Where is the Skywest flight coming in from? Coming in from San Diego, KSAN. All right, so he's on. These guys are both going to be punching burners here and getting out of the, our hair. And I think that's going to do it for us. I like these new earbuds. These are sweet. Keep my head cool. I just got a haircut today, too, so that's nice. But now I don't have these. The, the Logitech G432 headset, I'm not going to complain about. But I do think flipping the mic up and down loosens the connection so there may be a reliability issue there otherwise it's a really nice headset 
Um, but I got a set of what are these? Yeah, I gotta find the. Oh shoot! I put it over there where I can't reach it. Um. United seven zero four runway eight left at Alpha eight via Charlie three Bravo. Runway eight left at Alpha eight via Charlie three Bravo. United seven zero four. Southwest one one five five runway eight left line up and wait. Runway eight left line up and wait. Southwest one one five five. Let me see here. Let me tell you what uh, brand of earbuds I got. And like I said, Amazon was supposed to deliver them last night, but they were delayed, so they were here by eight o'clock this morning, which was before I woke up. But I got a picture showing me um, what I'd ordered. Tower, uh, Southwest one eight five nine are requesting push and start. Uh, where's my orders? Um, not now, no, not giving my phone number. Shut up. Uh, Cephia SP3060 earbuds. They're wired. I wasn't going to get wireless earbuds because then you have to worry about the charge running out on them. So, um, yeah, they were like $20 and they're real comfortable. They have memory foam pads on them and they sound really nice. So, yeah. New earbuds. I don't have the dollar ones. That, the ones I paid a dollar for yesterday at Walmart. I put Tower. those in the drawer. Southwest as a one nine or nine or seven with you. Runway eight so right. Sephia. Sephia. S e p h i a. Nice little earbuds. So. Allegiant five three two contact departure one two five point nine or see ya. Roger. Good day. Southwest three eight one nine or contact Vegas departure one two five point nine or good day. Roger. Good day. All right, I think that'll do, pig. 730 points. Busy day. Busy, busy session. We got a lot done. Went really well, too. Went sp okay, reconnected. Whew. Okay, Ooh, that was close. All right. So hopefully... I don't know, we had a brief little drop out there, guys. So hopefully you're still seeing this. Yep, sounds like we're good. We're back up and running. Okay, good. All right, so anyway, um, yeah. Hope everyone enjoyed that. Hope you learned something about Tower 3D Pro. It's a lot of fun. Uh, like my new end credits, uh, my outro screen here, it's actually a picture of the tower at Vegas, Lost Wages, with a Southwest 737 climbing into the sky. Not going to take you down to Memphis, but it might give you a ride. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the show. I hope you guys will give us a like. Share with your friends. Let them know about the channel. Let them know about Tower 3D Pro. Now available on Steam from feelthere.com. Uh, and it's a terrific game if you like some air traffic control simulation. A lot of fun. Uh, it's used, actually, to train air traffic controllers. So this is a very realistic simulator. It's got its bugs. It's got its issues. But there's also ways to work around that. And the key is to know which airports to pick. Most of them are good. San Francisco is one I won't play because you can't run it prototypically. Uh, Paris is the other one I won't play. Uh, San Diego I won't because uh, certain, I think the Dash 8 uh, prop jobs will not make a right-hand turn off the runway, and they tie everything up. But, uh, you know, Boston, New York, Kennedy, DFW, uh, Vegas, Sky Harbor, Honolulu. I like uh, Haneda, Tokyo. That's a lot of fun. Some of the overseas airports. Heathrow's pretty good. I like saying Speedbird. That's my favorite call sign. So you learn uh, you learn a lot from this. You learn how air traffic control kind of works. Uh, you learn airport, uh, airport designations. You learn airline call signs. And it's really kind of fun because you can actually log on to websites and listen in on tower uh, radio traffic. So it's something cool and interesting, especially if you fly. It's just another thing knowing. Like when we play Farm Simulator, it's interesting knowing how the equipment works in real life. So I think that's uh, that's educational and fun stuff. So hopefully, you yep, you're still hearing me, so that's good. Um, but uh, hope you guys enjoyed the show. Give us a like. Share with your friends. Let them know about the channel. Let them know about Tower 3D Pro. Subscribe for more great content coming soon. And there will be more great content coming very soon, probably within the hour. Uh, I'll probably target 5 36 o'clock i'm gonna have some dinner and then we're gonna get in some uh 
Farming Simulator 22 this evening. So, hey, Rocky Jet Project, I appreciate you hanging out there, buddy. And uh, good luck with it. Let us know how it goes on Discord. Hit me up if you have any questions. I'll be happy to help you out any way I can. And um, if I can figure it out, actually, you can two-player do this. Um, you can two-player do this. I don't think that made any sense. Um, you can have one person run the tower and one person run ground. So that's interesting. I've wanted to try it, but I don't know how to set it up. I think I need to look that up. Um, I don't know. There's a little thing where it's like you're looking into my computer sort of deal, and I don't know about the secure aspect of that. So, uh, But yeah, I think you'll enjoy it. It's a lot of fun. You get to fly anyway, so that's a super cool job. I used to work on airplanes, so I love aviation. Uh, we used to work on airplanes for the Air Force back in the early 90s. So, uh, And then... Uh, Make sure to subscribe, turn on that bell icon so you know when we go live or upload a video. Like I said, it's a Sunday, fun day, double play. We'll have a Farming Simulator coming up within the hour. So make sure you have that bell icon on so you know when we go live. You can check that out, and we'll do that for a few hours this evening. i give my voice a rest here for a minute. Uh, link to the Discord down in the description below. Make sure to join us on Discord. You can see my Steam library and my Tower 3D Pro library. Make game requests, discuss this and other games. Uh, share your experiences with this game or others. Pictures of your car, like Veronica, shared a picture of her 69, award-winning, excuse me, 69 Charger last night in the general chit-chat, so that's cool. Uh, also, if you feel like supporting the channel financially, I appreciate it. Uh, if you're seeing ads, YouTube, Google sucking up all that revenue, I get none of it because I don't have enough subscribers to warrant it yet. So if you can help us get uh, get up to 1,000, that'd be great. We appreciate you being here. And uh, your donations are welcome at paypal.me slash games. There's a link in the description below. Uh, the next purchase that that money will go towards is a webcam. So you guys will be able to look at my mug while I'm doing the various videos we're doing. So I think uh, the new microphone setup and earphones are working great. Hopefully it sounds great. And so now webcam is next up. So I uh, appreciate everyone being here and hope you have a great day, night, evening, morning, wherever you are on planet Earth or beyond. I'm A-Train. It's over. And I'm out. <laughs>